you doing? Nothing. Um, I'm actually working on a game with Shield. Uh, what's this all of this stuff? This is how we're going to make a lot of mobs. Really? A lot of. Because that's the theme of Game Jam. Really? Right, uh, what? Really? Yes. Do you want me, want me to show you how to do it? Yeah. Okay. So, remember when I asked you to give me different types of... Uh, you wrote down, you gave me this list of like astronaut, alien, ghost, and all these things like that. Like Dino Man? Yeah, Dino Man. Well, that's we my took, favorite. We took all those and we broke it down to bodies, heads, feet, and arms. Those are the four pieces we're going to put together. So what the game is going to do is it's going to roll the dice and okay. pick out a body, a head, feet, and arms. Now, to give it a name, each one of these has its own word attached to it. So, like, let's say it gets, we roll the dice, and we get a lizard body, and we get a chicken head, and we get left shark feet, and we get skeleton arms. You take the word from each list for it, and that would give us a scaly bok bok of the watery smack. Yeah. So, basically, in order to create the names for them, in order to put, yeah, what's up? So, it's like, if you took uh, a chicken? Yeah. Dino Man? Zombie and skeleton. What would it be called? That would be Lord Dino Dude of the Relentless Smack. <laughs> so that's the way we put together the names that's for it. That's a good it. one, right? That's great because it gives us a lot of combinations. It gives us a lot of unique names, and it's also going to give us a lot of creatures to combat. And in the next part of this, Geo's going to explain how we're going to do the combat and how these take part in deciding what kind of damage and attack it does. Okay. Alrighty? Cool.